Hi, I'm just another twin mom, and today I want to talk to you about a couple of the four moms products that I purchased in the past. But before we get into this content, make sure you like this video, subscribe, hit that bell so you get notifications of my other content. So hopping into the bassinet. The bassinet was everything that I needed it to be for my son. My son really, really loves motion. He still to this day loves motion. And a lot of times it's the only way I can get him to sleep. So for me, I needed this. All I had to do was buy the bassinet sheets and put those on and you're good to go. Yes, this is definitely on the pricier side because it is so expensive. I'm giving it for baby faces, but outside of that, it was, it was good. It did take up a lot of space. I will say that, so there's that as a factor, but overall it worked great. You could pick the motion and work with the app, which I'll talk about, about the app later. But yeah, I would recommend this product. So let's talk about the bathtub. So the bathtub for the four moms as a new parent is something I would buy all over again. It tells you if it's too hot, if it's too cold. As a new parent, definitely don't know, it, you know, temperature checks and it took the worry out of it. It's pretty simple, you just stick it and in your sink, wash your baby, and it drains out the bottom. I would give this for baby faces because it is on the expensive side, but if you can afford it or get it on a registry, I would highly, highly recommend it. Seems like it might fit in most sinks. The next product I'm going to rave about is the Mamaru. So the Mamaru, we bought two of them, obviously, one for each twin, and we got different designs, so we knew that the white one was hers and the gray one was his. We bought the inserts so they could be used when they were newborns, which you definitely need because otherwise they're gonna just kind of sink in there. As they get bigger, you won't need the inserts. You just take it right on out, comes right on out, and you, you can keep them strapped in. I would recommend you strap them in. I believe the manual says that they need to be strapped in, but when they're in motion, you definitely need them strapped in. There are several settings on the motion that you could do. You definitely get a good idea of which motion, which twin likes better as you continue to use it. For example, my son loved the kangaroo motion. He loved the hop and then the other hop and then it hops and then hops back. This Mamaru was working. When I tell you I got every penny out of it for this boy, I definitely did. My daughter liked the motion. Uh, she liked the, the more up and down, like hook motion, but she didn't really need it. She would use it, but she didn't really need it. I think for twin interaction, it was also really, really good that they could be next to each other and there'd be some programs like uh, we would watch, I think it's called Bear Adventures TV. They would watch that and be next to each other making sounds. It's just so cute that they get to be next to each other. A really good feature that this also has is that the app. So I kind of talked about it before at the bassinet. There is a four moms app that allows you to control all of the four moms products within it. It's not the fanciest, but it gets the job done. You can pick which device that you want to control. So if I'm looking at the Mamaru, I can say, hey, I want the speed on this Mamaru to be faster. And I could name them per baby. So I would say, hey, you know, baby A's, Mamaru, I want it to go to a speed of four, whereas baby B, I want it to be a speed of one. And I want, you know, it to do the kangaroo motion. You can control all of that through the app. So with the app along with the product itself, it was well worth it, well worth it. Uh, I, I think that there is a Bluetooth option. I know you can actually directly connect into it. We never used the music part of it because we didn't really need to, but we definitely use the app a lot. It gave me so much freedom. I highly recommend this if you want to be hands-free as a twin mom. This will allow you to do so whether they like motion or not. They're not on the floor. They're not up super high. It doesn't take up a ton of space, but it is effective and efficient. And you don't have to worry about them laying down. It allows them to kind of sit up more instead of just laying down like in the bassinet or in their crib. So for me, I am giving this for baby faces because I needed this. It gave me the opportunity to get things done, especially when I was solo and I didn't have anybody to be there to hold a baby or make sure they're in a safe place. Outside the playpen, this was a great thing to have. So I think they used it up to maybe like nine months, I wanna say. I have to check the manual to see how long you're supposed to be in there, but 
it, it was well worth it. You take the insert out. If they're able to almost fall out of it, you probably don't need to have them any, in it anymore. So I hope that this is helpful. I hope that this gives you some context of different products that we had and how we use them. I would definitely recommend the Four Moms brand because it was very good quality, although it is expensive. All right, so thank you for watching my video. If you like this content and would like to see more, make sure you check out my channel. If you also purchase products, please make sure you leave a comment, let me know what your experience is, and make sure you like this video. So if you like this and more, check out my channel. And as always, thanks for stopping. Bye.